Hello friends, welcome. So in this video I'm going to create a form for post and also store a new post for the specific uh, community. But before that, I'm going to change the post migration because I have made mistake. I have leave it uh, not communities, but my posts. Now this URL I want to be nullable. And also I'm going to say for the description to be nullable. So we can create a post only with title. Okay. And let's save it. And we need now to run the artisan migrate fresh. And because we make the migration fresh, we need to create a new user. So let's register a user. And we have something like this because we changed the Quest layout. So let's go inside the resources, JS, pages, out, register view. And here I'm going to add some classes with max with the b md mx auto i'm going to say bg white i'm going to add also the shadow here and maybe rounded md and padding the b6 save and we have something like this now. Let's create a new user, test user, test username, test email, and add the password, register. And we are going to send the email verification. So we need to verify the email. Here I have the mail trap, verify that email. And now if I come here and refresh, yeah. Now let's create also the community because we don't have, let's say Laravel and let's type something here and we have the community. Now inside the slash r slash Laravel, we have this create post. Oh, why we don't have that uh, style. So inside the Vue.js, the JS pages front end show page uh, we need to say bg indigo and uh, rounded uh, we have added around it so on hover to be bg indigo 300 and text to be white. Okay. And now we are okay. Good. Okay. Now let's uh, go inside the app, HTTP controllers, backend, community post controller, and create the method. create method and here we accept the community dollar sign community we need to import that one so import the community and if we go again back so inside the show here we added the slug as you can see and inside the models now we need to go to the community model and use the slug as a root key. So let's say function get root key name and return the slug. And because we are here, let's create also the relationship between community and the post. So 
public function with name post let's return dollar sign this has many post class okay and now we are going to use the slug as a root key name so inside the show when we use here we are okay good here now we need to return the create pages but we don't have that so inside the communities we're going to create a new folder name it posts and there a new file create dot view okay now if i return that file so in here i'm going to say return inertia render communities slash posts slash create okay and let's add also the community save refresh go and create and now we navigate dashboard communities laravel post create okay now in here what i'm going to do i'm going to copy what we have in the create community select all copy and paste it here if i save yeah we have the create community but we need to modify that we need the title the slug the title the url and the description for the post and also we need to change this here so first create post for and i'm going to display the community name here okay and if i refresh ah we need to expect the community here so we added the community in the inertia render command compact community so we need to say here define props community dot uh, sorry as an object why is no object like this save and the refresh and now yeah create post for laravel okay let's change now the breeze label for the title and this one is going to be title as well next one we have the description very good and we need the url so let's copy this one and use as url say breeze url title and this is going to be url and maybe type url as well save come here now we have title url and description and we need to say here class margin top to four because it's not the first one and we don't need out of focus here okay yeah now it's okay next one we need to change the script we have a community here we need an this is going to be title description and the url now form post road communities post dot store and we need here to add the community dot slug but it's not going to work so we need to say const props is going to be with define props and here we need to say props dot community slacks like this save and let's go in the 
community post controller and create the store method here. Say store. And here I'm going to use the store post request as the request. And we need the community, the last sign community. We need to import that. And let's go and add the validation rules here, change this to true. And say here what we need, we need to validate the title, which is going to be required. And let's say also minimum of uh, five. Okay. Next one is going to be the URL, which is not going to be required. It's going to be URL also, but not required. So we need to say here, a uh, nullable. Okay, next one, we need the description. nullable and description is going to be also minimum of uh, 10. Let's save. Close this one now and here what I'm going to do, I'm going to say the last time community post relation create and what we need in the posts Let's go here. We need the user ID, title slug. You are now the slug is going to autocomplete. We need the title, user ID, URL, and description. So create add an array. And for the user ID, we need to say auth ID. Like this for the title, let's say dollar sign request title. For the URL, request URL and description. Okay. And uh, now we need to return a redirect back to that uh, community show. But uh, if we go here in the roads web route, we add the road resource for the community, which are inside the dashboard. But we need to return to this one. And also we need to change this to be maybe front end dot communities.show and here we need the slug so let's save that and let's say here return and we need to use the redirect facade redirect illuminate support facades redirect route and watch route front end dot communities dot show and add here the dollar sign community slug community slug like this save let's go and test this one so let's say first post going to add this one URL Store, uh, yeah, the validation you can see is working. Click store and we are directed back to this one. So slash r slash Laravel. Okay, let's come here and refresh. We have that post with community ID one. And if I go here and create a new community, let's say Vue.js. 
store and now let's navigate slash r slash Vue.js and create a new, new post for this one. So I'm going to say Vue.js post. Type this one and let's say store now. Okay, come here, refresh again. And as you can see, community ID now is two. And title, slug, URL and description. Okay, this is how it's going to work and it's redirecting back to this uh, slash r slash URL. Okay, so it changed also the name here because I don't want to have subreddit in here and communities down there. So I make on only communities. Okay, friends, that's it about this video. I hope you enjoy and see you in the next one. All the best.